Get up. To start this season off, I'm heading up to Saskatchewan. And there's a lot to be excited about this year. Not only do I get to meet old friends I haven't seen in a while, plus I run into strangers that jump in with me. It's always neat to see their experience, you know, the first time, especially if we have a good hunt. Also, the biologists say this is one of the largest snow goose hatches we've had in 10 years. And that makes us all excited for this season to come. I think this might be not a bad little shoot for tomorrow. It's not huge, but they've been in here some time. And they're quite used to being in here, so I think uh, this might. Yeah, let's have a look there and see what you think. We just, there was more down the other side of the east side of the hill. Island. Yeah, I think. Okay. I think they'll get formation. another day out because they oh, were yeah. here last night. You they'll know, they'll so. be here tomorrow morning, but they're getting ready to leave. Yeah, when they're doing that, you know darn well they're running out of food, eh? Yeah, they're gonna cheek her. Usually a strong uh, formation like that tight in the horseshoe into the wind. That's when they're, they're not all spread out all over the field and that, they're tight. That's usually, uh, they're staying together. That group there, they usually be gone within two days, three days maybe, less weather, they're leaving. On this hunt, they forecasted not much wind. And as you know, as a snow goose hunter, that can be tough let alone trying to film it. You know, it's one of the reasons why I came out with the 360 air wings for those light wind situations. And also this year we released our new SX Flyer, which works good in light wind and strong winds. And I really like them for hide too in between the blinds. All we're gonna do is make the best of the situation and see what happens. I like to get out here in the morning before the guys set my formation, just the inside perimeter, and then they just fill the outside. But a lot of times this time of year up in Saskatchewan too, frost. So you try to wait that last second. So I'll just pull my decoy bags out, the SX socks, and just kind of leave them kind of where I want the guys to spread them out, scatter them out, and the last second set them up. We're still gonna get frost. There's really nothing you can do about it, but that's about the best you can do is just wait till the last minute. Said it goes quick. Just put three bags on each side, couple bags in the front, and we're done. Here we go. Good job, guys. Nice. Stay flat, stay flat, wait. Get up! Good, 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 good. Kill up! Let the first one come through a little ways, you guys. 